No, I'll take that too. Sweet. Why are we here, Atreus? Okay. You remember all those shrines we found telling the stories of giants? Yes. How the panel on the left would be their origin and the panel on the right would be their fate? Yes. We found many. I have seen them. Well, there's more to them than we realize. Was there? Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. No. Here we go. Come on. Wait, there's something over there. I want it. How do I get over there? No. Oh, there's something up there. Ah, things collapsing on a regular basis in these parts. Thimble winter wears down all things, even stone. Score. No, no. Let's see. There we go. I knew we could break that. There's a way to get to it from back here. Oh, it's another thingy. From the last game. You watching? Yes. It's a door. Well, that's new. Oh, well, no Morning. shit. Atreus, wait. Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. <clears throat> Thanks, Head. What is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here, inside. Hmm. You remember the story of Skull and Hati, the wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free. Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. It's not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are. Chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then hmm. the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse. I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Huh. Right? Mimir, can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? 
What if he's just had him locked up some more all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait. I have one more thing to show you. It's what? just out here. What is it? Out here? Oh. What is this? Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No. I found it in one of the other shrines. Other oh, shrines? How many have you visited? I... well... all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned. But I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. They mention black smoke and the bleeding earth. But we can never figure out exactly. We. Yeah, Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. It it wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Sindri, huh? Black smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muspelheim? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding earth? Sounds like a mine, aye. Uh, the realm of the dwarves, perhaps? Svartalfheim, that's a good bet. Your minds did belch black smoke. And Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. Hmm. That's it then. Tears and Svartal find somewhere, imprisoned in a mine. So, what now? Home. Home. Oh. We're not going on. Home. This way. Lad, even if we can trigger looking for Tia, how do you have us getting to Sparkle fight? You know Odin's had all travel between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. Yeah, he is. Beautiful. Huh. Ground looks kind of cracked there. It does. There's a shortcut this way. Hmm? Give me your stuff. To smash a few things for fun and profit. Damn well, right. Anything? No. Mumira, what did you hear of Odin's offer? To the lad? Not much. They stepped outside. But he told us about it. I wouldn't worry. What about the things he did not tell us? What's up? Oh. Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember mm -hmm. you lost control. We must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. How do you know? You okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. No, I probably didn't need that. Jeez. 
Jeez. Choose to adopt the strength of the mighty ox or the Vilgia. And visually speaking, it is qu quite obvious the massive hulking forms that can what buys nearly every part of their body should they throw their weight behind it. According to the Raider tradition, chiefs are chosen through several days and nights of combat trials. Only the strongest of the warriors are even given the chance. And by the end of the trials, most, if not all, of the contestants are dead, including the winner, due to the drastically dwindling numbers. I think they may have changed their methods. Methods. Beautiful. Alright. Let's go. Phew. Almost home. Brother. A word. Don't hold yes. the lad's curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. It makes a point a little bit. If we could find a way to open Rome travel to Sparta Farm, bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us to Enough. You will go. Really? But if we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search. For good. Oh right. You won't be sorry. All right. Where are we home? Over here. Sentry! As I live and breathe, is that a trace? It's been so trace? long. How you? Grown. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Well, if you'll follow me, Brock mentioned you needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. Oh, yeah. You're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. After you, my friends. Oh, so thank you. Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms, and I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms, till you can figure out your next moves. Good plan. Nearly there. As you can see, We've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimble Winter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't really? beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. Sendry's home. Man. Nice. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Nice spot there, Sendry. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet, very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay then. Your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any anybody need a snack? Kratos? Snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Alive? I mean that's what? It's okay. Say it's what? Everything. everything? You hated my son and disobeyed me. No, I I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... 
It's just, there's, it's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was something we needed your help with. Oh! The Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! <laughs> Not so fast. How'd that get in here? What the hell is it anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. And he looks like that. <laughs> I blame you. Now, come on, then. Let's get him something that fits, at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey, I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivant. You know this. Mmm. Busted up good. Mm-hmm. Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. Oh, thanks. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? Uh, craft and upgrade armor. Broadcast enough materials to forge a new shield. I only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. Shit for high, uh, a shield fit for high risk and high reward. Parry sold to craft. A shield fit for absorbing tax and striking back. Beautiful. Kid's gonna insist on getting taller. Best make a habit of swinging in for new duds. There we go. Look, looking fancy. Armor that allows the wearable additional movement around the joints. It is construction that allows the user to swing their weapons with more force, increasing their strength. I like when it does a little bit of both, so we'll go this one. Beautiful. Hmm. Looks like Fimble Winner's been hard on our girl. Give her here. She's open for some frock. Beautiful. Found some items you left behind. Tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look around. Oh, sweetheart. Check out my room. Why'd you leave Tell me? Tell when you're ready. Thank you. The Dwarven Blacksmith Brock was the first ally we encountered when we set out for the mountain peaks. He and his brother Sindri made a Leviathan axe for Fay, And this has been our common bond. Brock is blunt with a foul tongue, but there is a wisdom in his bluster. I find him acceptable company. I like him too. This place is Let's 
Is that mine from? Well, I don't remember. Increase sign it out to airborne enemies. Ah, I mean, no, wrong button. Oh. Uh, brothers, we investment armor crafted with care by the Nuria. What's in here? No, nah, flipping thing. Hey, come what? see. What I guess got? this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. What was your clue? Finding everything all right, I hope. Yes. How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me. And be sure to bring the head. Uh, yeah. So, where exactly is Tyr being held? He's in prison. Uh, Sindri, on our journey to Jotunheim, Sindri proved himself a capable blacksmith and a valuable ally. Now he has been helping Atreus in his search for Tyr. I am unhappy that he was done without my lodge, though it is better Atreus was not alone on this path. I will attempt to sp spare the dwarf my wrath it may not be easy. In a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours. Sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. Hmm. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader from New Mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel no. leader? Derlin? Atreus. All right. See you out there, Sindri. You hear that? What? We'll just need the Bifrost in the head. Brock, do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, <laughs> Cynthia! Bastard! Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eye with clamps. Do it. <laughs> oh! That's it. That's it. Good. Now, release. Still no unpleasant. <gasps> no. That's our cue. Come on, hurry. I'm coming. I'm coming. Russell the X-Man, what was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just there. That should do it. No, oh, would you look at that? See? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck. Great George! <laughs> throw me at him. Horns fuss. <laughs> Kids, you take a joke, you old goat. <laughs> Give me my friend, I guess. The Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. Nice. I also used it for light. Okay. Good note. I'll figure something out. But first, come on. Let me show you how it works. Aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right, then concentrate. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And moist. they're everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck. Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck. Where's he going then? Oh. All right. That's it's dying. Need to plug it in. That's enough for the day. You like, leave comments, subscribes. Later.